With the end of the school year nearing, many parents might be wondering how they can start prepping for students applying to colleges in Idaho. Next Steps Idaho has tools for students in the Gem State. Today we're joined by Jenny Kimball with the State Board of Education. Welcome. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. So for parents watching at home, uh, what can they tell their kids about preparing to apply for college? Yeah, you know, it's really important that students understand that they have a lot of options. You know, in Idaho especially, we have amazing two-year mm -hmm. colleges, community colleges, technical colleges, as well as our four-year institutions, both public and private. Um, so it's a really good idea to check out as many options as you can, maybe take a campus tour. Um, and we also have a website called Next Steps Idaho that's a great resource for students and parents to learn more about their options. Those campus tours are truly key. Yes. You don't know what you love, right, until you you until go. you know yes. exactly, exactly. Um, for because it's April so for the fall is it too late to apply you know what it's not in fact the state of Idaho is pretty unique we actually have a common application called apply Idaho that allows students to apply for up to 10 of our Idaho colleges for free and it's open until June 30th is so that new it's been around now for a few years okay. um, but it 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 is a game changer for students because it, it allows them to apply within 20, 25 minutes, like I said, for free to up to 10 colleges in Idaho. And it's open until June 30th. So they have plenty of time. If they haven't made a decision yet or all of a sudden they're like, oh my gosh, I'm graduating, yeah. I should make a plan, they can still go online and apply. Oh, that's a great tool. Okay, so for next year, for those looking ahead, planning yep. in advance, what can they be doing now? Yeah, so we really recommend thinking about, you know, what's important to you, right? Like, what, what programs are you interested in? What careers might you want to go into? And again, if those are questions that you're like, I have no idea what the answers are, we really recommend using some of the career interest inventories that we have on the Next Steps Idaho website to really start narrowing down what you're good at, what you enjoy, um, and then really thinking about what programs uh, could fit those interests. Um, and then we also recommend, you know, maybe do a, a job shadow or an interview interview with someone who's doing a job that you think sounds interesting. I think it's so hard for students to picture themselves somewhere in a career that they haven't ever experienced before. So we really recommend trying to get out there, get as much information, do some experiential learning um, before applying. That is great advice. Okay, scholarships. This is a big thing I know a lot of oh, students yeah. and parents want to know about. Yes. What is available? Yes, so um, the state of Idaho, we at the state board, we actually manage several scholarship programs. Um, there's two big ones that I wanna talk about today. The first one is the Idaho Opportunity Scholarship. That scholarship has been around for several years now. It's up to $3,500 and it is renewable for up to four years. Um, so that's a big one. We have over 6,000 students um, who receive that scholarship every year. You do have to have a 2.7 GPA and complete your FAFSA, which is the free application for federal students aid so definitely keep that in mind um, the deadline for that has passed for this year's seniors but for next year it opens October 1st so they'll have October 1st through March 1st to apply for that scholarship okay. and then the second one is Idaho launch which I'm sure many students have heard about this year it's the first year for Idaho launch um, and so that program really helps students who are planning to go into in-demand careers. So if they um, have chosen a field that is an in-demand path, then they can get up to $8,000 to help for training for that program. Yeah. So yeah, great, some great program. Yes. Yep. Yep. Oh, well, this is obviously uh, right now in springtime, very important advice. So we appreciate you sharing yeah. this with our viewers at home and yeah, no appreciate you coming into the studio yeah, today. Thank you for having me. It's yes. great. So we'll be right back after this.